Howdy folks, welcome to episode 20. Today we're over at the coal mine. As you see over here, we're at the coal mine. And what I want to do is I want to make a way to get down to this valley. So we are way down here at the lower right and we need to go up this valley that's all across the right. But the first thing we need to do is um, get down to, I want to go through the valley floor. So I want to take the scenic route through the valley floor. And so what we're going to do is we're going to uh, put a track from here going all the way down. So we're going to start, I think we're going to start with um, uh, here. We're going to start with some groundwork and we're going to start over this way. See if we can get this to raise up. We want to get above that coal, I think. I don't think it's that important, but yeah. So the plan is here. Yeah, I don't think the coal is super important to get over it, but it's more of a decorative thing, but we're going to do this anyway. We're going to do it this way. And let's we'll see if we can get this to sit right across these. So like this. There we go. And then once we get past that, what we want to do is we want to come out kind of go this way, kind of like we did on the other one, where we're going to go toward the wall, and then we're going to curve out that way. So, actually, I don't think we need to curve toward the wall. But we're going to do it anyway, because just cause, so we can get a little bit smoother. A little bit smoother. Of a curve. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make a really steep hill um, so that the... We're gonna we're gonna bring a, a gear train out here that's just gonna sit out this way, and we'll bring the load out the lesser slope uh, with the with the faster train, because the thing with the gear trains is they can go up, uh, they can climb and pull more, but they're slow, and I don't want to spend like an hour waiting for the train to get down the track on this valley. I don't, I, I don't mind taking the scenic route, but I don't want to take forever on the scenic route either, you know. Um, so we're going to go like this, and then we should be able to, should be able to, to, yeah, we've got a nice smooth curve there. We should be able to do a bridge here, and I think we're going to have to take that one out. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make a, um, we're going to have to make some groundwork that comes out here, and we might want to curve this a little bit less. Let's see. Let's go like this. We're gonna we're gonna start our groundwork first because we want to come out right over here. I think because there's a nice there's some support. Yeah, actually, if we come out this corner, then we can go go leave the support on this hill and kind of go that way. Maybe turn it right here so we can hit the corner of that hill, and then we're basically gonna go over almost to that other ridge and see if we can hit the ground there. So we're gonna come out here. Whoops, I don't wanna do it there. Let's put down a water tower so we can see where we're trying to aim for, right? So we wanna go just to the side of this. All right. Then we should be able to come out with our groundwork here and hit that. Basically put it on a straight angle with it. See, then we don't have ugly curves, right? So we're gonna go like this. And we're gonna come out this way. And curve just a little bit. There we go. All right, so our bridge is gonna start going off the edge there. I think that's what we'll do. And let's get rid of the groundwork. So what we're gonna do in this episode is we're gonna do all that, we're gonna lay down all this and as much as we can, and then we'll get the, um, good, it's, there's no gap there, okay. And then we'll get the um, track laid down in a bonus episode. So I think what we wanna do is we probably wanna put a thing down there. Let's see if we can clear out some of this logging here. Right, we're gonna wanna basically lay a path from here down. 
see if we can get some groundwork across here. We'll get all these out of here. There we go. Okay, that should leave us a little bit more of a visible path. And then we can come across here. So let's lay down our groundwork. Stone wall. We're gonna go like this. Now I thought about going the other way and around that that um, waterfall, but the thing is that we're um, we're already going past one waterfall, so I don't think we really particularly need to. There we go. And that should help with our bridge. Hopefully we can fit a bridge out here. Let's see if it'll let us do it. If we can get up this little, there we go. All right, so we're gonna lay a bridge across here. And I think we're gonna do a steel trestle. And can we, and then we're gonna go we're going to go down three degrees and we're going to try to follow this three degrees. Will it let me? It just really wants to go that way, doesn't it? There. All right. And then we'll see if it'll let us get over this. I think that's the bottom. All right. Let's go like this too. turn off our alt key so we can go a little bit more this way. There we go. You know what we need to do is, actually, we need to end this because um, we need our bridge to come down, not at three degrees. And we need these to come down at different angles. So in order to do that, we have to actually, there. Oh, I just had it too. <laughs> come on, you can do it, there we go. Okay, so yeah, we need this to come out at different angles. So we don't want it to be 3% all the way. We want this to come down to 7%. So we're gonna go like this, and we're gonna come down, we're gonna go three, five, and then seven. So, let's see if we can do it. There we go. And then this one is gonna be, seven degrees so we're gonna go seven degrees or six point nine 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 because they're using floating point numbers all right and then we'll see if we can get down here did it did it drop that piece did it do it or there we go and then a bit more I think it's stuck in straight line mode, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, it is. Okay. So let's see if we can get this to go across this gap. And then we'll see what we have as far as distance goes. We might have to do some curving around and stuff like that in order to get past this. The other thing we can do is we could go over to that other thing here. We can go over to the other uh, ledge and then come down that too. Let's try to go like this. Let's see if we can get that to show up down here. There we go. This way a little bit more. There we go. And are we going to be able to get this to come out here? We need to go that way see how that looks yeah it's fairly straight all right and then I think we're gonna have to add more of the whatchamacallit I think we're gonna have to stop the bridge here and no maybe maybe not okay so this reminds me of like the, the here Sesame Street at the very end of Sesame Street they have that harmonica piece it's kind of that same pace all right um, here. Although they didn't have the guitar. <laughs> All 
All right, let's tr see if we can get, yeah, we can get a little bit more and then we're, I think we're gonna have to put groundwork after this. I don't think we're gonna get, with, get away with this too much longer. No, maybe not. All right. Let's see if we can go like this. Where's it gonna end it for us, right? Right up there. Is it gonna let us? Oh, we might be able to get across this gap. Oh, that's cool. Okay. The trick is trying to see where you're lined up with this. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Because then you run into trees. That's the biggest trick on that. You can do it. You run into trees and then you have to change your angle and it messes things up, right? So are we going to run into this hill? Okay, yeah, we're going to run into this hill. See what we can do. We're probably going to have to change this. We'll see. There we go. But at least this will give us an idea of what kind of grade we're looking at. You know, how much climbing and dropping and all that stuff we need to do. So this will definitely help. And what do we have up ahead here? We still have more of this. See, I think we're going to have to start curving toward this. I think that's what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to start curving toward that in order to get that to happen. So let's try, see what we have here. We're just going to go in a straight line and see what we hit. see where we hit. So we've got that. We could probably come back, do a curve to the left and come down. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see if, that, if that's possible. So if we go like this. Yeah, we're going to hit the ground here, aren't we? Huh. I don't think we're going to be able to get through this. I don't know, we'll see. Let's see if we can get this to come over this way. Yeah, it's too much. Okay. So at least now we have a better idea and if nothing else we have a scaffold we can use to look at where we need to go. But I don't think we need to curve this way to do a loop to get down to that level. So what we can do is, uh, somewhere around the middle here, we can start curving that way. Because that's what we want to do, is we want to hit... We want to hit this ledge right over there. I think that's the trick, is we want to hit that ledge right there. Now I'm kind of thinking we should lay a piece of track there so we can hit the right curve. But we'll just go like this, bridges. Where's our joint? Is this a joint in a bridge? It kind of looks like it. Let's go like... I don't want to demolish the bridge. I really don't want to demolish the bridge, so we're just going to do this. And we're going to go down seven. See, why is this going down at a higher rate? We had it set at seven, didn't we? Why is it suddenly going down... Okay. Let me see. This is ten this is ten percent and is still not keeping up with that. How does that make any sense? What what is it doing then? I'll bet the grade is different negative than it is positive. Yeah, that's a ten percent. And it's still not keeping up. Aha. Okay. That made no sense. All right, so over here somewhere, facilities, water tower. We're going to make a water tower down here. We're going to put it there. <laughs> All right, so this is our plan. We're going to try remaking this bridge from some point here. I don't know where it went down to 10%, but apparently it did. Can we get that? Yeah, thank you. Get rid of that one. 
and this one here. Because we kind of want to stick to this hill and then curve after we hit the, get off the hill. No, we're going to have to come down at 7%. The, the, um, the trains that we're using are not, the engines that we're using are not going to succeed at a 10% a grade with the amount of cars I want to bring on them. So we're going to go like this, and then we're going to go seven. All right, so we're going to go 7%. And we're going to bring this out to pretty much the length that it'll let us. We're going to go out this way so we can look backwards and see where it's at. There we go. And then we're going to bring this out a little bit more, just a little bit. Need to come back more so I can see where I'm going. Yeah, this is why I didn't want to do this down here. It's not going to let me do it. Okay, we're going to have to go like this. All right, so we're going to go like, and then we're going to start coming out even. like that, and then we're gonna have to start slowly winding our way back a little bit. Kinda come neutral here. There we go. And I think this is what we did last time as we laid one right there. What am I hitting? Oh, I'm hitting the trestle, okay. All right, we're gonna have to go like this. We want to do really smooth curves on this because we don't want to be, um, here, let's see if we can hit this. We don't want to be uh, doing sharp curves because that adds to the friction. So yeah, it'll slow down. It's basically the, whoa, you need smooth curves to be able to carry more weight. All right, you lose tractive power, whatever it's called. Go. Can we go this way a little bit? There we go. Is it? Did it put two segments? No. Okay, it's just the other one trying to do that. All right. Curve a little bit more. Right there. How much room do we have? Oh yeah, we got room to, to curve before this hill. Okay. What we may end up doing is using the thing to, to create a smooth curve too. Let's see, we want to go like this. These segments are shorter than I keep thinking they're going to be. There we go. A little bit more. Come over this way a little bit more again. And then let's see if we can curve this. Let's see what's gonna happen here. We are still at 7%, right? Yeah, okay, <laughs> just checking. And I can't see around the tree. Okay. Is that is that decent? A little bit more. How's that looking? Oh yeah, that's nice. Okay. I'm not sure that we're gonna be able to see through this. Can't see through this stupid tree. Alright, so we're at this angle. We need to go like that.
and then we're gonna go like this. So I think we are going to need to uh, bend this a little bit. Let's see. Maybe we'll make it. Is it going to let us? That looks like about the closest we're going to be able to get without going completely through the ground, right? Let's see. Let's see what kind of curve that gives us. Oh, we might be able to do it. Yeah, I think we can lay the track on the inside there. Okay, cool. And we're going to try to come back more, as much as we can, as much as we can get away with because this is flattens out right here, so we can stop at the curves here. There we go. And as much as we can get away with there. There we go. And then I think we'll probably just convert to the to the thing after that. Let's try getting rid of these trees so we can see what our path looks like. Get rid of some of these anyway. So we should be able to get a better look at Come on, get out of the way. At our path. Is it gonna fall? Go away. All right. <laughs> Stupid mother nature. Yeah, I think we can do that. I think we can handle that with the tracks. This may need a little bit more of a curve. We can try it. Let's go like this bridges steel trestle bridge and hopefully this is one of the joints right it looks like it so we're gonna curve seven percent see why is it doing this we set it to seven percent why is it not seven percent it said it I don't understand that. We didn't change that at all, right? All right, so we're gonna come in a little bit more, maybe. I'm trying to think of where we need to start curving, maybe here. Go like this. All right. Because if that's more than 7%, we're in big trouble, you know? All right, we're gonna go like this. Oh, we need to do that, okay. This needs to come in more. Yeah, because if the rest of that whole bridge is more than 7%, then, we're, I mean, we're, we've got a problem. We're not gonna be able to climb up it. We're gonna go like this. There we go. And then we should be able to bring this up a little bit more. Especially coming down that hill, we want to be very careful about how um, <laughs> about how sharp we're turning coming down a giant hill, right? If it'll let me put that there. There we go. And we're going to go like this. It's almost like it changes it after the fact, you know? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it's doing, but... Go like this. And then we can hopefully get this to go along here. All right, that should work. 
Let's take these bridges out. What we can do is if we lay track across this, we can basically put new bridges underneath the track, worst case, in order to get the bridges to look right. But we should be able to get the old bridges out of here. Ah, that's what, see, that's what I was looking I was hoping it wasn't going to do that. Okay. Um, see, it. we put it at 7. And now it needs to go 9. I don't understand where it where it's doing that and why and how okay because that means our entire bridge is completely different than what we set it to be yeah I don't know I'm gonna have to look at it in a mapper and figure it out it might be that it's that it's doing like a sigmoid type curve and we'll figure it out but we're gonna do our groundwork I'll, I'll get rid of that other bridge over there later on We'll do that in the bonus episode. I don't want to do that in this full episode. So we'll come down here and we'll get our... Um, we'll hit the ground is the plan here. We'll get our groundwork to come down to the ground level. And then we're going to basically have to make a little switching station in a loop and stuff like that. So groundwork. Variable stone wall. And then we're going to come down. 7%. Let's see what we've got here. I can't see what angle that is. Yeah, that looks like it'll work. I want it to come more into the, into the, whatchamacallit, but we'll see. We can put bridges in here if we need to. All right, it's gonna come down to here. We need it to go through. There we go. And then this is going to come down to this level right here. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to clear out a bunch of these logs so we can see, so that we can set up a, um, a place. Oh, that's beautiful though. Because our train's going to come in from this valley. And so we'll be able to take this valley all the way up. Yeah, see, we'll be able to take that valley all the way up that valley to the other waterfall to the smelter. So then we'll be able to come down here. And then when we hit this, that's when our other train is going to be parked over here and it's going to take over. So let's get some of this cleared out and we can see what... Um, what we can put in here is we will need like a loop we need a way to turn around the engine anyway and I think maybe instead of a giant loop well we want to be able to turn around both I'm just trying to think of how I want to do this because our main our main thing is going to come in this way right let's go like this It's going to come in here. We'll do that. We'll get some grade going here. Okay, so it's going to come in here. And then we're going to have... We're going to want to park, park our engine off to the side, maybe. So what we can do is we can have a switch go off to the side there. And then the main... Yeah, actually, I don't think we need, need that much of a switching yard. Because what we can do is we can have... Our train comes in here. There's a switch here. There's a switch here that allows us to uh, park our engine. And then we're going to need another switch over here. So let's go, like, demolish groundwork. Get rid of this piece. And we're going to put in our...
like this. Okay, so our train's gonna come in this way. We want it to go like this. Why is it doing that thing where it's insisting on laying level? Okay, so I want this I want this one to point that way. So we need to come this way more. That's going to be the trick, is we want this. You know what? Let's do this a different way. Demolish rails. Let's get rid of this tree, too. Some of these trees, so we can see what we're doing. I think what we want to do is we want to come in this way. We're going to lay our groundwork if it'll let me, if I can see what I'm doing, right? We're gonna go like this. There we go. So our track is gonna go like this. So when we come into town, right, we're gonna branch off to this direction and then we're gonna go like this and yeah we need to put more groundwork there okay so let's put more groundwork here like this is that gonna be on the same height yeah it is okay and we just want to come out this way so our one track is gonna go like that and then our other track is gonna go the other way I'm sorry trails our trails our trails for the caravan are going to go that way. Okay, um, not groundwork. We want to do switch left. And then we're going to lay our groundwork out. We'll come out to here and then we'll go this way. There we go. Okay, we probably should put a third switch so that we can leave the cars, but I think this will suffice for right now. I know that's what I'm saying, but... <laughs> and then when we go to to bring the cars down, then we have to put in a new switch, and then we can't get the tracks to align, and right? Okay. Get some of this cleared out here so we can have a little breathing room and see what we're doing. There we go. Okay, so our train is going to come from the valley, and we're going to go like this, our caravan of buggies, that is. <laughs> All right, and then this is going to go like that. There we go. So that's going to go up at 2%. Let's demolish our groundwork over here. We don't need it anymore. And then, yeah, our track is going to go up that way. So we can lay more over here. I just want to show you what we're doing here. So the class 70 will come up this way. And we'll sit here on this line. Our Heisler or Climax, our gear train. We'll sit here on this track for storage. Okay. And we'll probably have like a water. We need to put like a firewood depot or water or something like that down here too. Probably need to put water, right? A real one. What is that line there? Is that line the center of the where the train is? Or is that line where the edge of the ties are or where the rail is? I have no idea. But that's where our water tower is going to sit. So that we can fill up our engine if we need to. And then what we need to do is come back this way. And we'll have to decide what uh, grade we're going to want to do. And we're probably just going to go variable grade and follow the... Whatever the... Um, 
here. We're going to come up a couple degrees. And we'll just follow whatever the uh, thing is. So we're going to go steel trestle bridge here. And we're going to go level if we can. There we go. All right, cool. And then we're going to go like this. This is going to be variable grade. Okay, so we're going to stay about that high off the ground, I think. But it looks like this comes back up. So why don't we go like this and see what we can do. We're going to try to hug the terrain here as best we can. So can we come up or down? Does it matter? Yeah, we can go down a little bit. Like this. We'll hug the terrain. And I think we're gonna go back across the river. Should we go back across the river or should we yeah, let's go back across the river. I want to have a bunch of river crossings. I think it'll look cool if we do that. Okay, so can we put... I know that's really low, isn't it? So we need to do this. We need to demolish this piece. And we need to come up a little bit. Groundwork. And we're going to go up a couple degrees. There, how's that look? Yeah, that looks better. Okay. You just don't want our bridge to be right on the top of the water. Because then you get like, you know, logs come down the river and, and destroy your destroy your bridge, right? All right. So we got that. Get rid of this, as long as we're going into the menu. Right? Okay. Couple of these. All right, so then we're gonna continue with our groundwork. Can we come up? One degree. Okay, one degree works. And I don't want it to be too invisible because then we can't find it, right? Two degrees. There, zero degrees. Apparently this is all downhill, isn't it? What do we need to do to get above this hill? Two degree? Okay. Is that going to be too sharp of a curve there? Let's see. No, that's fine. Alright. We're going to come up this hill. Are we going to go across the river again? Or are we going to maybe follow this hill? Let's see what we have. Yeah, we can kind of hug this left side here a little bit. Or we can go across. Yeah, let's go across again. Groundwork. There we go. Bridge. And we'll come across. To there. Oh, this is going to be cool. Now I'm leaving it on the force force it to go straight setting here. Yeah, see, that should be a, enough clearance from the water. And can we get that? Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. 
Can we get up on there? Nope. We're gonna have to go to the, across. Yeah, see, that should be enough clearance for, for flotsam or whatever they call it, floating down the river, right? We're gonna have to go way back, aren't we? I might want to change that piece, but we'll do that later. We just need to get a, a basic path worked out. I'm gonna hit these while we're here. And this one. All right, so we're gonna get some more groundwork through here. Ah, oh, I just did that, didn't I? <laughs> All right, what we do is we go like this, and we go like this. This is how we get up there. All right, groundwork. All right, and we're gonna have to curve a little to the left. Let's go one, negative one. Curving a little bit to the left. I think we're gonna come across the river again. Maybe go beside it. See what we can do here. I think we're gonna go across it again. Cool. No complaints from me. I love going across the rivers. What is that right there? Oh, it's just between the two textures. Okay, interesting. We're gonna hit that spot. Okay. <laughs> All right, more bridges. one might be a little bit low but that's okay we'll survive Let's go like this let's see what that looks like yeah that one's a little bit low if you were doing this realistically you'd raise that up but we're just gonna leave it as is for right now we need to start coming this way I think we need to hit this. What do we have there? Okay, so we want to do, if we're going to do that, we're going to use the, the other one. Let's get this stupid tree out of the way. Right? So you can see what we're doing. Okay, we're gonna use the other groundwork. We're gonna use this one. So we're gonna start maybe here. And then we're gonna go like this. We're gonna hug the edge of the wall here if we can. I don't want to go too much more than 2%, so Let's see what we've got here. And I don't want to go super sharp corners. I want to be able to go like full blast through this thing. Let's see. We could probably come down to 3% for like a little bit, right? We come toward the wall. See, if we come toward the wall, then we're going to hit it, and then we're going to have to turn really sharp to not hit the wall again. So, this spot right here. See, that's where it's going to match up right there. All right, let's go back to 2%. See if that matches up. Yeah, that matches up well. Okay.
This is going to be really sharp, isn't it? That's going to turn. Okay. We are not going to turn that sharp. We did that on the way down to the smelter. There we go. Should we just come across? We're still way, we got a long ways to go. Okay. We're gonna come away from the wall, I think. And we're gonna go this way. There we go. All right, and then we're gonna try to get our bridge to go across. So let's go like this. Can we get it to go there? There we go. Whoops, I hit the wrong key, wrong button. There we go. All right, we have a groundwork. <laughs> we can do our bridge. Across here. Right there. Okay, and then we're gonna have to go back up on there. Let's get some of this out of the way. What do we have here? Because I can't see what's going on over here. Need to wait for this stupid tree to get out of the way. Come on, tree. You can do it. There we go. Okay, so we've got more... I don't know what we have over there. Groundwork. Let's go like this. Is that going to go... Let's see what's up ahead here. Either way. Because we're like going right down the middle. This doesn't seem right. Okay, we're going to go along the river. Maybe. And we're going at 3%. Okay. Should be able to go across again. I like that trick. All right, so let's go like this. A little bit more. And we're gonna come down there. Bridge doesn't need to be perfectly level. Alright, let's go like this. Whoa, I almost fell off. Okay. <laughs> Variable stone wall. Whoops, I didn't want a 0%. Hold on. Demolish groundwork. And variable stone wall. We need to, yeah, we need to start coming down at 3%. Because apparently 2% is just isn't enough. Yeah, and it's dropping even more. Yeah, we need to get along one of these canyon walls. One or the other canyon wall. Try this. And... 
Let me get rid of that one. All right, let's get our groundwork in here. We'll see if we can get it up there or we need another piece. Uh, we need another piece, don't we? One more. One more piece of groundwork and that'll get up. Okay, groundwork. There. There we go. All right. So we want to put a bridge across here. This might be a little bit too much of the um, not following the terrain. I wanted to follow the terrain more than this. Is that all the way across? Yeah, it is. Okay. We're going to try to curve toward the terrain here. There. And then we're going to get rid of this stupid tree. Can we get rid of that one? Okay, let's see if we can do our stone wall here. 3%. We're going to have to go with 3% because the 2% just isn't doing it. There we go. We'll get up to these walls here. Those trees make it are so like in the way. And then we can I think we need to come up to about here. Right about there. Can we do it? There we go. All right. And then we're going to try to see if we can follow some of this wall here. And I think we're going to need to do this in order just to get by. To be able to see what we're doing. All right, and then 3%. Let's see if we can get up here and see what we're gonna, where it's going to go. There we go. There. It's just such a weird, uh, because of the way the the angle that we've got going to that, it's, yeah, it's just kind of weird. Tiny little movement of the mouse moves it all the way down that hill because of the angle we're looking at it. Okay, and then should we come across again? It's hard to, it's hard to say. It's hard to decide. It doesn't want to let me go any less than that. All right, we're gonna go like this. There we go. Let's go like this. See what that does. There we go. Right over here. Okay. 
There we go. We're gonna have to put in some bridge sections here or something. Can we get it to move this way? There we go. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, that's okay. All right. And then it looks like we're gonna have to go across again. Man, that's a long path, isn't it? And, and it's a lot of climb too. It sure doesn't seem like it, does it? Now it's finally gonna come down low, right? All right, did I just get caught in there? I totally did. There we go. All right, and then we're gonna go up. We'll put our bridge across. Okay. <laughs> the Camp Town Lady. All right, let's see what we got here. There. And then we're going to go like this. Variable stone wall. 3%. Alright, so where are we on the map? We need to kind of stay on this side if we can. Let's see if we can go like this. Two percent, zero percent. How's that look? Oh yeah, it looks nice. All right, can we follow the edge of the river maybe? I mean, that would be kind of cool. The river should be fairly level, unless there's like a waterfall. Still have room for our tracks? Yeah, barely. Should we go across again? I think we should go across again. So why don't we take this out and we're gonna we're gonna do that. We're gonna take this out. We're gonna go across. We're gonna come up a little bit. So let's get these stupid trees out of the way so we can see what we're doing. And then we're going to come up to here, and then we're going to go across. Okay. Groundwork. Let's do constant. Constant stone wall. Whoops. Try that again. Constant stone wall. It's a little bit better. Let's see what 3% gets us. I think we can follow the thing. I think we can follow the river. Why don't we just do that? Variable stone wall. Let's see what level does, right? There we go. I think this will look cool coming all the way along the river here. Then we need to start dropping again, huh? Okay. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, cool. I like it. 
We're staying level here. Let's come up a degree. Maybe two. There we go. There we go. Uh, I guess we need to come up there. Okay. So let's go back a few segments. We need to come up a couple degrees here. So it's because these trees were in the way we couldn't see. Blame it on the trees. There we go. Couple degrees. There we go. Should we go across? I think we should go across here. We haven't crossed in a little bit. And then one more segment. And then we're gonna go up. There. Beautiful. Up two degrees. And then we should be able to continue our stone wall. Should we do the stone wall or should we do the... Yeah, we've been doing the stone wall this whole way. We're just going to keep it consistent. I think this is going to come back up again. Yeah, this is going to come back up again, so we do need it to, to meet. Do need it to, to yeah, stay over the ground here. Okay. All right, and then we can, uh, you know what? I think we came up too much. We came up too much. Okay, so let's demolish this one. We're gonna get in line with this. All right. Okay, cool. We should be able to continue from here. Probably put some bridges in here or something. Yeah, I think we should probably put some bridges in here to break this up. close we're getting. Oh, we're starting to get there. Cool. This is all level right here, too. Almost. It's coming back up again. The thing is, I want this to be really smooth, not huge curves, so we can basically just... Um, you know, put the 
put the reg at full or whatever it is, you know, basically we can just, if we want to, we can full throttle all the way through this. Should we go across again? Yeah, we need to go across again because we're starting to go that way. All right, let's go bridge because we're, whoops, we're pointing that way. Yeah, we need to go across and start turning north again. There we go. Can we get up on there? Yay, perfect. Groundwork. Trying to get to this before we finish up. So where does the river go? It goes that way. Okay. I'm just trying to decide if we can go north at all. I think we need to go between these two. Yeah, we pretty much need to go between these two. Going back that way again? Yeah, we are. We don't want to go that way. Although I guess we don't have much choice, do we? We have we have to go around that. Okay. Yep, we're gonna keep going then. There. Yeah, that's going to be a mess, isn't it? All right, bridge. I know we're running pretty long today, but I'm kind of hoping to finish this before uh, before we have to end the episode. Can we do it? There we go. We're going to need, yeah, we're going to need to go up. There we go. All right. We're going to turn here. Let's see how far we can go level. Where are we at? We're coming toward the smelter, I think. We're heading right for that waterfall, which is where I wanted to go. Let's see what we can do here. We'll go back to one. I think I'm seeing blue over there. No, I think that's just the mountainside. All right, we're going to have to start dropping here. Huh, big valley here, isn't it? Okay, let's see where we are. We should be able to see the valley from here somewhere. We're going to need to make a guidepost or something. I think this is it right here. Yeah, there we go. Cool. So the smelter is down that way, and we want to come across this waterfall here. Okay. Alright, well, I think we're going to call it here, and it's going to be it for episode 20. Join me in episode 21. And what we're going to do is we're going to do a 21, 20 and a half. We're going to clean up this stuff, get all the trees out of the way and clear a path and then at 21 we're going to try to finish this down to the smelter and then test it out so i'll get all the tracks on here too so that we don't have to lay all the tracks for for 21 but yeah we'll get this to go 
that way. So yeah, that's going to be it for episode 20. Join me in episode 21, and we'll see you then. Later.